Hey church family, this is Pastor Luke here. So it's Thursday, we want to continue on our daily connection. Thursdays are going to be our three thanks Thursday. You might be able to hear in the background a loud noise. I'm going to turn so we get it in there. You see that tractor going. You know, I'd be honest with you, this may sound weird for some of you. Others are going to love this. But I'm actually thankful for seeing this tractor out here plowing the fields. Because that means that, you know, growth is coming. Spring is, spring is here and the crops are going to start coming up. And boy, I just... There's just something in me, maybe it's because I grew up around farms and stuff. I just love seeing crops growing up and uh, seeing this stuff happen. It's just a miracle to me to see to see how God has created all of this. He put this little seed in this field over here, and next thing you know, we have these seven, eight foot tall corn stalks. And, and uh, you know, I'm, I'm just thankful for that. Some of you may think that's kind of strange, but, but I love it. I love seeing that. You know, my other thing that I'm thankful for, my number two, and this isn't in order and priority because some of you are going to think like, really, you're, that's the thing that you're most thankful for? And number two, your kids come in too? <laughs> uh, so there's no priority to this. But number two, um, you know, I'm just so thankful for my kiddos. This time that we've had to spend home uh, with them not being able to go into school, uh, having some really quality time as a family. Boy, I I'll tell you, it's, it's been a while since we've had that. And uh I am so grateful for it. I know that this is a struggle with the virus for, for lots of us. Um, but on the positive side, uh, this, the time that I've had with my with my kiddos and my family has, has just been tremendous. And, uh, you know, number three, obviously, again, this isn't in priority, so do not... Well, some of you going to do it, and it's fine. I like to joke around and have fun with things, too. But number three, coming in in third place is my wife. <laughs> but, you know, Kelly has been such a tremendous support to me for so long it was interesting just yet just the other day it wasn't yesterday two days ago she uh she kind of got this serious look and she looked at me and she said do you realize that in just a couple months it's going to be 17 years of marriage I was like wow man that's a long time um and you know all those years she's been so supportive of the decisions that we've made and we've had we've had some hard decisions throughout the years that really has affected her and, and our family that she's been supportive with and not just supportive but you know she's been uh, she's been a trooper in the sense of taking on extra responsibilities and and also making fun with with everything that wherever we're at uh, what what kind of looked as they look like a, a difficult maybe transition you know Kelly does a great job of, of creating fun with it both for me and for the kids and I'm so thankful for that. So that's my three Thanksgiving Thursday. I'm thankful for that tractor. I don't know if you can see it. There it is in the background, uh, plowing up those fields in spring here and things are gonna start growing and that's exciting to see. I'm thankful for the time that I've had with my kiddos since we've been home. And I'm thankful for my wife and all the support that she had. So, hey, I'm gonna post this and I just want you to share with some other people um, three things that you're thankful for on three Thanksgiving Thursday. All right, take care, church. Love you. Can't wait to see you again.